Hi, this lecture is cheating cases in the restaurant scene. As you can see here, the camera's far too close because you cannot see under the table. It's very important that you see under the table. I'll explain in a minute. So the camera has been moved back and you can see just as much under the table as you can on top of the table. So what's going on at the table? Well, number one, the woman here is very nervous. She's looking around. He's a little calmer, but that's that's probably just their personalities. It does not mean that he's not married. She's married necessarily. You can see the props going up and affection going on underneath the table. Affection with the uh, her foot rubbing his leg. Now, what I mean by props on the table is the iPads, laptops. They're trying to make it look like it's a working lunch in case someone were to go by the restaurant, come through and see them. They would have a kind of an explanation as to what they're doing but uh, let's watch and uh, see what transpires here so they're conversing they're not using any of their props as I call them and this is quite common to see that now this is interesting here I always focus in on jewelry uh, I have had some wives see their jewelry on other women and it can go either way but even if they don't recognize the jewelry he may be spending marital assets in other words their money on these items of jewelry for this woman so in cases that are in states where there's no fault divorce sometimes this is the angle the shared marital assets you can see here that he is taking out cash instead of a credit card and this is quite common he might have gone to a bank machine before they arrived there he doesn't want a, a trail of evidence which tells me that maybe he is married we'll see so he's leaving the restaurant separate from her this is very common with hotels events restaurants where they try to leave separately so he goes to his car but he stands there turns around and watches her come out so she comes out and goes to a car that is very close to his and we'll see what happens here now here she comes with her purse and all her props as we call them and she's looking around a little bit sometimes people look around they don't know what they're looking for they're they're might be looking for someone just standing there with a camera they don't expect someone to be hidden in a car or a long distance away so she goes to her car here and her car is the red car his car is the yellow car and the pi's car is the blue car so she leaves first she's in front he's behind her following people that are driving in a convoy so to speak is very difficult because they may not be going to the same place if you're following the person in the back and the person in the front goes a different route you can get held up or you can lose that person if the person in front was your priority so here's what they're doing she's driving into the parking lot next door maybe it's a more private location he's following her there now once the pi realizes what they're doing he needs to get into motion so that he doesn't pull up when they're already in the one vehicle and looking around before they get into any sort of romance so he's getting into position here just assume that the parking lot is almost full of cars and he's parking right there his windshield to their windshield but look what he does he doesn't just sit in his car uh, the pi gets out of his car puts his back to them because remember they could have seen his front in the restaurant puts his back to him acts like he's talking on the cell phone he hits his door lock twice once to lock it once to unlock it you see people um kind of you know locking their car twice so that's not uncommon and he walks around the other side of his vehicle so he's totally hidden from them comes up into the passenger seat slides in of course his lights in his vehicle are always set to off PIs always put their interior lights off and he films from the back seat which is safer than the front seat because if you're using an LED screen or even a 
eyepiece on your camcorder, you can still emit light inside your car. So sitting further back is a little bit better. And um, this is a good position uh, to get film. Now, on domestic cases, you get film and the first opportunity. Don't wait around for a better setup, a better opportunity, because it may never happen. Um, this is a good opportunity right here. And even though it may have seemed a little aggressive for him to get in there, it's not. It's the opportunity that uh, dictates what you do. Thank you.